So you're going to either respect the profit or you're going to make a profit. Okay, that's what Nebo is. When Moses died on Mount, when Moses is really thought most, what that was saying, he crossed over when Mercury was in retrograde. The same thing Martin Luther King said, for my eyes have seen the glory and the coming of the Lord. In his speech, yes. he knew he was going. Yeah. He was calling on Mercury, I'm out. If I'd have seen it, I'd have been to the mountaintop. Ping! Masonic. He was throwing us a message too. Even though he was not doing positive law, when he realized he was not doing positive law, he did not know how to tell us because they cut off that part of the speech. He said, oh my God, I then took my people in a burning building and nailed it yet. And he failed, okay? Okay, and where was he assassinated at? Or where did he smoke weed at? Because that's what assassin means. <laughs> that's all it means, marijuana, hemp, the assassin. Oh, yes, that's what I mean. Get blazed. That's all it means. That's all it is. It ain't got nothing to do with all this. Ching, ching, ching. They were potheads who sat around and read a lot of literature and killed people verbally. The tongue is mightier than the sword. Don't believe the way they have reconstructed history, people. <laughs> and peace. So you heard what the sister said, right? Don't listen to them on how they confuse history. So I'm going to use that. But matter of fact, that video is what made me go by the name Morris Assassin in the first place. Because all I used to do was smoke weed. But I don't smoke no more. So just to, tell you what, this, just to tell you why I took that off the name, but I kept the Morris. And as I was going through it, I realized I can take it all full circle from Assassin all the way back to more and explain some things to y'all. So here we go. As she, as she told y'all, Assassin really simply means... A hashes addict, as you can see. Hashes, right? We're we'll, we, we going to go to that in a minute. But you see how they put a member of a secret order of Muslims. Notice it doesn't say Muslim. It says Muslim. All right, there's a difference. Who terrorized and killed Christian crusaders. Now, we know the Christian crusaders was when they went through and was murdering all of our people. So that should tell you who our people are, Muslims, like the like the prophet Noah Jali said. All right, so let's go to hashes. We're going to go to some etymology. We're going to get into this. Hold on. All right, so hashes, right? See, assassin went back to hashes. Hashes, a purified abstract prepared of dry fruit of the hemp plant. Smoked or chewed. Smoke some. In the Orient. See, it says Orient. All right, as a mild narcotic. Also formerly hash. Arabic. Hashes, hemp, dried grass. So let's see what they're talking about when they say Orient, right? All right, and that 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 lecture is what even made me go by Morris Assassin, just FYI. But anyway, Orient, right? Capital, the East. Very important. I'm going to show you in a minute. Eastern regions, countries of Asia, especially in Eastern Asia. Compare Occidental, Occidental. We're going to go there in a second and show you the difference between the original person and the Occidental, right? The Orient Moon of what? Islam. Islam. All right. All right. Let's go to Occidental. Okay. Occidental. Of a pertaining to the country of the Occident. Occident. Their peoples, their countries. Western. What do they call it? Modern America. Western. Right? But look what it really is. The countries of Europe. Europe, okay, see, occasion, all right, let's go up to occasion, an event or happening, all right, so what are they saying, they're saying that the occasion or occidental people came at a certain time or were created later in time, and the orient was in the east originally, that's why they used to say it's two people, the Occidental and the Orientals. Okay, like the Prophet Nobu Ali said, it was Asiatics and Europeans. All right, so, but to occasion, come up here, you see, we're going to go to CAD in the appendix. And I forgot to go show you that for Orient, we're going to go to see Ur. 
in the appendix. These are the root words. So you got cad and er, right? Let's go. So you see cad to fall, right? Meaning a de evolved person, an accident occasion. You see, accidental occasion. Okay, meaning created people, later day created people. The accident. <laughs> Hold on. Er, to set in motion the original people, oriental, to be, to exist. And just to further confirm, check it out. Go down to Earth 3, Earth, ground. All right. Now, you, 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 I'm going to show you how this all relates to more, the way I personally spell Moorish and the reason why I did it that way. All right. Hold on. So you see, I spell it like this. M-U-R-A-Y-S-H. Now, under it, I got the Hebrew letters correspond to the English letters M U R A A I N I N is that word and sh and sh <laughs> no I, I'm really not telling you the sh the word is literally uh shin <laughs> okay so the, so sh is shin all right and Hebrew is writ written backwards so it'll be spelled like this so that's why I spell morish is more ish right okay so hold on, I'm gonna show you in this book here, which I always show and mine is kind of messed up, Kabbalistic Encyclopedia, what this H really, what this H means or what this H is, right? And why I spelled it in that manner. Check it. Come here. Asia or Asia, or as the Prophet Noble Jali said, Asiatics. Because Asia is the material world or Earth, right? Just like in the uh, root word of uh, Oriental, right? Er was was um, Earth. Okay, Asia. Let me see. Look, also spelled Asia, whence the continent derived its name. Hence the final he of the Tetragrammaton. Now, anybody who knows. Uh, Kabbalistics, you know, the Tetragrammaton is the name of God. Yah, what they, what we in call in English, Yahweh. Right? It's Y H W H. Right? Hold on, hold on. In Kabbalistic sciences, you have the four worlds. All right, so you got the four worlds. All right? This book here is what I'm reading out of Total Kabbalah by Maggie Whitehouse. Right, the four worlds, as the grand design of creation unfolded, the quality of light changed. It emanated through the world of Adam Kagmon, expressing itself as pure fire. As it flowed farther, constructed the world of spirit, where the archangel existed, it became air. It formed the, the world of images, angels, and emotions. It became water. Finally, it completed its journey, and it made it earth. All right, so you see the four worlds in Jacob's Ladder. Right, each world or level blends through to the next one. Each world descends from the center point of the one above it. All right. To absolute. Then the Briar. Then the Yetzara. Yetzara. And then the Asha. Earth. See? That's Jacob's ladder in your Bible. Fire, I said fire, water, air, earth. I mean, it's fire, air, water, earth. Excuse me. At least as far as she's concerned. Which corresponds to the four letters in the name of God. Y-H-U-H. Y-H-W-H. Yahweh. Right? And the last one is the world, the material world, which is Earth. Asia. So this is why we are Asiatics. Because we were the first beings that walked this Earth. Kabbalah speaks of the four worlds. From the most spiritual to the most material. Okay? Corresponds also to the four elements, fire, um, water, air, earth, as well. Okay, so it's, it's, you see, it's all science and what we and what and what the prophet taught and what Moorish science is in general, way beyond some religion. Now, I still ain't through. I ain't I really ain't got started. So you see, I spell my name like that, right? So that's why I put more M U R. H, H, more H, 
That's really what this more ish is about when we say more ish Americans. Okay, so let's go to the Strong's Concordance. This here, and you can see the correspondence. Hold on. So you see the word Asia, right? Asia, my pen. And what's the definition? Yah has made, or Jah has made. Who is Jah? Yah or Yahweh? Or my Hebrew Israelites said, and call him Jah, right? Or Yah, right? And you see, it's from six. 6213 and 3050. 6213 is ish, ish, to do or make. Because as I said, we were the first things created, first beings created, right? That's why we Asiatics. Okay, now remember the other one was 3050, right? That's where this word comes from, this compound word. Let's go to 3050. 3050. Uh, uh, contrary to 3068, the same as Yah, the sacred name, the Lord. Right? The Lord. Okay, so the Lord made man. The Orientals, the Moorish Asiatics. You get it? Let's go to 3068. What is that? My Hebrew Israelite said, Y-H-U-H, Yahuwah, Yahweh, self-existence. <laughs> self I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't even gonna go there. But you see, it's Jehovah. Is that what you Christians call it too? That's what you Christians call him too? Jehovah? Your Lord, Jehovah, Yahweh. You see? Asiatics. You get it now? So that's why I spelled it more ish assassin. But since I don't smoke no more, I took the assassin off. I'm still more ish. You see, Asia is Asia. Yah is Yah is Yahweh. So you get it now when the Prophet Noble Jew Ali told you. We Moorish Americans, we Asiatics. Alright? Peace.